Hey, Brakai Hau, Brakai Hau Shai, Kalai Hau Brakai Hau Shai, Brakai Hau Kaka Dash, Devon is the elder of Pastor Great Bill from Blue Will. You see the citation of Ashka for some of the truth, the cut the four corners of the earth. You see the fear of Sally Hau Brakai Hau Shai, the double bullet. And shout out to the blue stick to that truth, and to the spirit. And who work in the call God is in your house. And who work in the call Jesus Christ in your house Shai. But he really liked that some sits the so called Negroes, Latinos. And they married to Indians and those line descendants go back to the children's tribe of Israel due to the scatterings among the nations of the four corners of the earth. This is Mahari Call from the great Liverpool, Los Angeles camp. Back to another legend. And I'm not going to die. I'm going to be edifying to the same as how you have us now. Shy. By Shy. I was like a dash. The Holy Spirit. So I'm going to take the body of how you have us Shy. The Spirit will be the dude's collection. Y'all, yeah, it's the NATO member war of World War III and Ukraine joint bloc. Right, because Russia already said, all right, if the Ukraine was to join NATO, right, with the North Atlantic Treaty Organization, right, which is the beast spoken of in Revelation 13, all right, there's about many waters, all right, to the people, all right, it said it would uh, go to war, all right, because that's the, uh, 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 direct attacks on Russia, obviously, all right, being that Ukraine is right in, in, in uh, Russia's front yard, okay? So, so you, uh, uh, the NATO is currently surrounded Russia right now, all right? It's surrounded Russia, if you look at this map, Russia is all surrounded by NATO uh, members. Okay, so that's a, a threat to them. All right, it's the um, Ukrainian exception into NATO, where we go in World War Three. Hungarian Foreign Minister Peter, like how to pronounce that, had warned Slovakia, a fellow member of the U.S.-led military bloc, previously vowed to stonewall P.I. candidacy over fear of a of a conflict with Russia. Speaking of the state Petersburg's International Gas Forum on Thursday, right, that Peter, right, the Hungarian foreign minister, stated that Ukraine is at war with Russia due to the traditional NATO stance. So Ukraine be brought into the alliance under current circumstances, it would mean the start of World War III. We have always stood against direct confrontation between Russia and NATO. And the Hungarian diplomat added, he had quoted by Russian media, Slovak Prime Minister Robert Fico made similar remark last week, insisting the government will never agree to Ukraine membership in NATO due to the threat of a world war world war poll by such a move. Both nations have dissented from Russian policy, spearheaded by U.S. President Joe Biden a sending army funds to Kiev for as long as it takes to defeat Russia. Right? And that because the spirit here because um, the lady all right, that sit at the top of the beat is American. All right? They're the spearhead of NATO. All right? They control NATO. All right? But now, you know, Americans losing their uh, uh, power and their influence over uh, the NATO. Right? And that's why you read in Revelation chapter 17 going to the beach y'all hate the whore. So all the allies of, of, of the United States of America are going to turn against them. and shoot their, They're going to help in the destruction of America along with Russia, China, and all the uh, other countries as well. Okay? They get the scripture. Let's speak about World War III. All right? It's Matthew 24. Instead, that you shall hear a word and rumors of war, see that you be not trouble. But all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet, right? These things are supposed to happen for property state when your house side return. All these things are going to take place, all right? And we know your house side is going to uh, return, all right, in the midst of property taking of voting. With your house side return is also part of property, all right? When you read in 2nd Edge chapter 13. Speak about how you're gonna come in the midst of World War Three, all right? 
in the valley of the digits are uh, Armageddon. I just simply mean a mountain of truth in the Hebrew. Like all these nations are right, gonna gather together in that region, all right, in Western East, Western um, Asia to fight. All right, and then when the Lord comes, they're gonna fight the Lord. All right. In Joel chapter three, all these things leading up to World War Three for prophecy to uh, take place. The Lord is setting this up perfectly. All right, setting up the fear on these men. All right, these leaders. All right. To work in tangent for property state. Okay. Revelation 11 and 14. The second world is past, which was World War II. And behold, the third world comes quickly. Okay, and we know that we're in the third world right now. We're in the beginning of, of, of World War III right now. Okay. The beginning stages. Alright, it's the build up. Alright, and it's going to be more conflict. More uh, strikes, more bombings going to be taking place. All right, let's see what's going on in Israel. All right, Iran's bombing the shit out of Beirut right now. All right, so it's on and pop right now, like hot bit grease on a Sunday morning. All right, so that's what's going on right now. Okay, is there any more else on this? The NATO pledge to bring Ukraine into the fold in 2008 in Northern Russia warning that it considered the proposal a major threat to its national security. Why didn't it happen in 2008? Because it wasn't a fair of the Lord to happen that way. All right. But now we're in 2024. All right. What was that? Uh, 24, 8, like 15 years later. All right. Now they're talking about it. Okay. The Ukraine conflict which erupted in February 2022 was triggered to a large degree by the military bloc effort to absorb TI, according to Russian officials. All right. With Moscow currently making gain on the battlefield, some Russian media outlet and officials have suggested that TI should concede territory lost to Moscow in exchange for security guarantee. All right. All in all, it's all working for the spirit of the Lord, how about shine for these policies to take place, all right? With that.